budget your business and your life. I know this is a <laughs> this is a big one. Sometimes it's not easy. A lot of people don't like to work with numbers, but I'm gonna explain to you how I organize all my expense and how I organize all my income. Um, you can find this spreadsheet at the bottom of this video and I'm gonna explain to you how this spreadsheet works. I'm gonna show you with a video how you need to use it. So let's start from the first things. Personal account. What you need to do? Print the last six months or your bank statement, okay? And check all your fixed expenses and write down on this spreadsheet, on this side, all your expense, right? Your mortgage, your rent, your rental insurance, your electricity, your gas, your car payment, your Amazon Prime membership, your gym membership, Write down everything, everything that is related to your personal life, and everything that you put out every month. Remember, council tax, maintenance, uh, all the kind of registrations that you have, you know that they get paid annually, so just divide them, divide 12, and you will get what you need to pay every month. Business account. Same things, bring the last six months of your bank statement, check all your expense. If you don't have a business account already, as I said at the beginning, open one now. Start to check how much money you spend for your business. From, I don't know, if you use your fuel for your car for work. If your car is just for work, so just check your car insurance. Your public transport, your work insurance, everything that is work related needs to go on this spreadsheet. On the other side, you will see all your income. I just divided the self-employed income, dividends, and if you have got any side hustle work, um, if you do other work, if you have got your pension. Only your income for your business will go on this total income, okay? And your side business, because if you do another job, then maybe it's like happening two times a month, you can just keep track also of that job. I'm going to show you an example of uh, how this spreadsheet works and I will explain more you in detail how I do it. So guys, let me show you how this, uh, this monthly budget works. So as you can see here, I have had a couple of expense just to show you, uh, let's say the mortgage expense or the rent expense, your electricity, your gas and grocery, uh, your membership for the gym, your Amazon Prime membership. Um, and in here is like all the expense related to your uh, work from the phone, uh, public transport, your work insurance and uh, your Spotify membership, your phone loan if you pay for a loan for your phone. And as you can see, the total of these two expenses um, is going in this side here. So you can see the total of your expense, and this is the total of your income. So in this case, I will put also a side business income, but if you take this off, uh, you will see all, only the income of your, uh, your self-employed business. Um, and what I've done in here, you could also add other income if you want to do it. I don't know if you have got any dividends income coming from your, or any, uh, your uh, investment or if you have got uh, a pension that, uh, as, as an income. So it's, it's quite easy to use, as you can see, and easy to, to change if you want to change anything, like if you want to move something and just put a zero in, in everywhere in here. So that's is coming back to normal. And if you want to change any of these because you don't need it, uh, you can easily change uh, with another line. And if you want to add another line, it's simple as that. Just insert another line and this will be add to, to the total of, um, of everything. So that's it for the monetary budget, guys. Thanks.